What is up everyone, welcome to another Super Smash Bros. Ultimate video. In today's video, I'm going to be talking to you about one of Kazuya's most underutilized tools out of his combos and ways to extend his combos that I don't see a lot of Kazuya players using that can catch your opponent off guard and can lead to some really crazy uh, combos and kills. Before we start today's video, I always like, as always, make sure to subscribe down below if you haven't before. Uh, I make all sorts of Smash content, including these types of guide videos, and if you guys want to see more of them, make sure to stick around because I upload every single day. But without any further ado, as you saw in the title, um, what we're going to be talking about today is Kazuya's ability to footstool out of electric. So the first thing that you have to know about um, is electric, obviously. You know, it's Kazuya's signature move. It leaves your opponent in a stunned position where they cannot do anything. Uh, you can input it really. Uh, it takes a lot of practice to input it. If you haven't already, I have a lot of guides on my channel um, talking about how to correctly input it. Um, but over time, you do get better. Uh, I suggest warming up your hands before you actually try to play it because it does require um, precise inputs. I think there's only either a frame of mistake that you can do um, to actually input an electric. But most people, obviously, when you see Kazuya's do electrics, right, the most common combo you'll see it at is usually grab and usually combo it into um, fast fall and air into like other stuff to extend your combos and to get the damage percents and usually what ends up happening a lot of times is that you'll see your opponent uh, around 70 percent because once you get um, grab electric falling in air electric your opponent's at about 50 percent right and on certain light characters when you go up for the other nair right they'll instead bounce off the ground instead of um just going farther because they're at too high of a percent right if, if you it's like if you near low you see they bounce off the stage right there so certain characters pass a certain percent where you're going to do your normal electric combos they end up uh getting too high percent and you're not able to finish off the combo with the kill which is the uh what you want to do out of most of Kaz's combos right or your opponent will be at such a percent where the up smash doesn't kill and then you're stuck with your opponent at high percent and now they have the advantage because you're trying to find that kill um, but this option helps you to uh, be able to footstool so we're basically out of um, Kazu's combo you can actually uh, electric you can actually footstool pretty reliably like that so basically what I do is I have jump set to my L button and I you can basically just mash L because you want to get your double jump out before uh, Lucina or your opponent is out of the tumble animation from electric and you basically just mash uh, L you're going to click it three times, one for the normal jump, one for the double jump, and then once you've used your double jump, uh, Ultimate has a thing where if you just mash L, the only option you can get is footstool, right? Because you have no more jumps. So when you mash L, you're going to automatically get the footstool above your opponent. So the combo goes like this. It's similar to the Kazuya's EBU combo. Basically, what you're going to do is you're going to get your electric, you're going to do their footstool, fast fall nair into a nair, fast fall nair into a uh, strong dragon fist uppercut. And as you can see, at just 0%, the full tilt of this combo does about 57%. But the point of this combo is basically make sure that your opponent isn't conditioned. Because eventually what will happen is your opponent will be conditioned to your electrics and will DI a way that you miss up. Like you, you might miss up your input if um, the Lucina decides to uh, DI away and out instead of in. So you might mess up your electric, but now you're able to catch your opponents off guard because since the footstool is guaranteed, it's kind of like a Pyro Mithra side beat. Uh, if you can, uh, or Pyro specifically side beat, if you can master the uh, footstools off of it and they miss the tech, it's basically a free kill for you just because of how many um, follow-ups Nair has. And this works especially around like... Once you get your opponent, like I said, off to the second electric, they're going to be around 50%, right? So your electric is going to send, the, its electric does around 70%, right? So you're going to be at 67%. At this point, if you try to do a nair, they're going to either fall out of it, or it's going to bounce them off the stage like that. So now, instead of doing the nair, you're going to do the footstool and hopefully successfully get the footstool like i said it does take a little bit of practice to consistently get the footstool especially if you don't you don't normally footstool in your game uh or when you're normally playing it can be a little bit difficult but you're gonna get the footstool into that and that's a true combo right so as you can see in the side it's a true combo from the nair to the electric input and you can buffer the electric input as soon as you hit the nair 
Uh, sometimes I have tried this and you do mess up, you might accidentally get forward tilt if you hold it wrong. So just make sure to practice buffering it a little bit. Um, but once you get the thing, obviously at like higher percent, you're going to be around this percent. You know, you can play around with um, the combo. Obviously, this combo does not work if you um, if your opponent hits the tech, which is the only thing. Like, but it only work. It doesn't work for the opponent if they still if they tech in place. Like, if the Lucina was to tech in place right there, uh, you would still hit, get hit with a nair. There's not enough time for them to shield if you time it correctly. Uh, for them to be able to shield before they get hit with that. Like, look at that. That's a true combo that kills 55% off one electric. Normally, there is no way to kill off of this electric other than the fact that maybe an up smash will kill. But as you can see, at this percent with a max charge up smash that's possible, uh, you're not going to be able to do that. You're going to have to be forced to... Your opponent will live, first of all, and you won't get the kill. This ensures the kill, and it's the only way to ensure the kill at this earlier percent. Um, other than that, you're going to be like you're just gonna, um, your opponent might be able to be killed if you hit them with like maybe a backer and really weak, but even that doesn't kill. So this is your only kill option at low percents, and I think it's something that a lot of Kazuyas should be using. Now the options for if they tech, obviously you're going to be covering rolls. Like, you're, cause like I said, if they tech in, you're going to hit them still. So you can cover rolls with that. And the best option normally to cover rolls is just um, the land grab because it sends your opponent into an off-stage position that you really like as Kazuya because you can do, you can force them off-stage with an air, you can fight them off-stage with forward air to damp them, you can do down air, which is always, always a reliable option. But in general, the footstool is just really good out of Kazuya's electric combos because you can do this at any percent, right? As long as they miss the tech, you're good, and they will, a lot of opponents, so by they miss the tech a lot because they don't really understand what's happening. Like, it kind of befuddles them that you even got a footstool. And in certain situations, at like lower percents, you can even start off your combos with the electric footstool. Because you can just combo the light nair at lower percents into another electric and continue your combo. If you just truly feel like, like if you get an electric and you're like, bang, I'm gonna miss my combo, you can do turn it into your own electric combo, which is something that works at lower percent. Like, I only see sometimes you'll you get like the accidental input for the um, the normal uh the normal one, and you'll end up mashing electric again, and you'll want to get the second one, so your opponent is a little higher in the air, and that's still possible because instead of having to like you know then your, your nair won't com combo you can't do drag down nair so instead what you're going to do is just go for the footstool because you can get guaranteed um situation damage out of that and you can continue the combo what do you guys think about this are you guys gonna do you think footstools are really good for kazuya i want to know what you guys think down in the comments down below as always i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you guys next time